Welcome to my channel, Narc Delusion. My name is Nicole. On this channel, we focus on all things narcissism. If you find this type of content helpful or interesting, please comment, like, share, and subscribe. The subject of this video is Narcissists Generate Garbage and Trash. Narcissists refuse to be accountable for their own actions. They deny having to grow up, improve, and mature. For these reasons, narcissists generate a lot of toxic garbage and trash. Often, the narcissist is reacting to a severe abandonment issue and their demanding overreactions are a response to the insulting, toxic voices that they have inside their heads. Narcissists are very needy. They are on a very slippery slope during this time. No matter how many times you reassure a narcissist it is never enough. Never forget that a narcissist will never be there for you. They are never there for you. You are always there for them. Some like to claim that narcissist parent other personalities that is not the case. A real, true narcissist is probably about two years old. They can have a lot of worldly knowledge, but their emotional needs and their personal viewpoints and their backbone is extremely underdeveloped. The true malignant narcissist needs their partner to be there as their backbone. All of the narcissist's complaining, machinations, posturing, and whining creates all types of disruptions and disturbances throughout their entire being. All this negative energy and demands begin to weigh on the supply. Especially in the area of their relationships, the narcissist's overgrown egos always leads the way, even while they are personally disintegrating. While they are afraid, hapless, and weak, the narcissist still insists on being more important and more significant than anyone else. Because the narcissist is unable to accept self-responsibility, they are never going to improve. The narcissist careen from situation to situation, hoping to find a dumping ground for their toxic garbage. The narcissists make many errors in judgment and they don't want to acknowledge this. They do not want to accept any responsibility and they point their fingers away from themselves. Narcissists Blame shifting becomes increasingly complicated as they usually like to include other people. The narcissist is hapless and helpless and few unable to accomplish much of anything on their own. Narcissists like to bring in other people or flying monkeys, 
or third parties to further bully, control, impede, and further trash a situation. The narcissist loves to create division, use flying monkeys, and triangulate in their drive for attention, control, and supply. So often, there are many eyes on the narcissist during their messy fails and belly flops. This is simply unacceptable to the narcissist. The narcissist repeat the same egotistical mistakes and miscalculations. Beware the narcissist blame-shifting tactics and projections to buffer themselves from social rejection. The narcissist refuses any self-responsibility and is unable to learn anything from their personal role in their many failed misfortunes. The narcissist is carrying a huge load of garbage and trash that they are looking to dump and unload. The narcissist has traveled far with many discarded supply victims in their past. The narcissists know what they did, but they don't want to accept it. They want someone to carry their garbage and trash. The narcissist is looking to offload their noxious garbage. They are looking for someone to carry their trash because it is getting too burdensome. In their view, it is best to blame someone else. Because the narcissist refuse to admit their own mistakes, their narcissist is also refusing to grow as a person. The inner landscape of a narcissist is a garbage-strewn dump site. The narcissist continues to machinate and posture among the filth. The narcissist is contriving and devising a setup to set up a stooge. The narc wants to trade places with you. The narc stays stuck in their filth and refuse to attend to anything. The malignant, sadistic narcissist is very unkept. Their inner landscape is disorganized, fragmented, noxious, and toxic. They are overly preoccupied about obtaining supply and attention. All the while, they are rotting from the inside out. There is a lot of confusion and toxic mess generated by the narc's excessive reactive tactics. The dysfunctional narcissist creates a lot of misunderstandings and creates new additional problems. Some of these narcissists really have no clue as to what they are doing. The narcissist's plan is to jet off, leaving all blame behind with you. In summary, don't be ensnared by these ignorant, low vibration narcissists. Leave them to stew in their filth and garbage. Get out of the way, leaving their garbage and trash with you is one of the major reasons 
why they want to keep you in their games. Understanding the selfish narcissist is the only way to protect against their emotional and predatory abuse. I hope you find this content helpful and interesting. Please comment, like, share, and subscribe. If you would like to support my channel, my PayPal link is in the video description below. Remember to hit that notification bell for when new videos are uploaded. Thank you for watching.